Universitas Brawijaya is a state university located in the city of Malang, East Java, Indonesia. It was established on January 5, 1963, and this date later proclaimed as Universitas Brawijaya's anniversary or Dias Natalis. On 2008, Universitas Brawijaya introduced an official acronym called UB. UB is recognized as one of the prestigious universities in Indonesia and consistently ranked in top 8 national level in these recent years. In international level, based on QS World University Ranking, on 2019, UB is ranked 800 plus worldwide. Universitas Brawijaya is currently led by Nofil Hanani and its vision is becoming an outstanding world-class university and able to take active part in national development through education, research, and community service. UB has 16 faculties with 175 study programs with almost 14,000 students entered and graduated every year. One of the first established faculties in Universitas Brawijaya is Faculty of Engineering. The faculty that has a jargon 123 technique is always in great demand by prospective students every year. It's proven as the second biggest enthusiast after Faculty of Medicine. Currently, the Faculty of Engineering is led by Dr. Insinyur Pitoyo Trijuono MT. There are eight departments in this faculty, such as Civil Engineering, Mechanical Engineering, Electrical Engineering, Water Resources Engineering, Architecture, Urban and Regional Planning, Industrial Engineering, and Chemical Engineering. The undergraduate programs in those departments are all accredited A, except the newest department, which is Chemical Engineering, is accredited B. Department of Civil Engineering Universitas Brawijaya was the first department established in Faculty of Engineering Universitas Brawijaya in October 23, 1963. This department was initiated by Insinyur Imam Sucipto, Insinyur Sumadi, M. Sujadi, and Practical Engineers in Malang. By referring to Universitas Brawijaya's strategic plan, Civil Engineering Department has a vision to be civil engineering education institutions that act globally and has competitiveness insight by the year of 2020. To achieve that and also support quality improvement of this department, Civil Engineering Universitas Brawijaya has international cooperations with several overseas universities such as National Central University Taiwan, University of Miyazaki Japan, University of Southern Queensland Australia, University Tun Hussein on Malaysia, and many more. To support programs held by Civil Engineering Universitas Brawijaya, Civil Engineering Universitas Brawijaya also cooperates with companies and government such as PT Waskita, PT Wijaya Karya, PT Nindya Karya, Utama Karya, Ministry of Public Works and Housing, and Polri. Civil Engineering Universitas Brawijaya always strives to produce the best graduates every year. Therefore, this department provides student learning facilities such as comfortable and spacious lecture hall or classroom equipped with air conditioner. Each lecturer has their own room to increase student concentration in consultation. Study spaces at the campus hallways are open for all students. Teaching preparation room that operates website called Sijak displaying schedules, lecturers, and classroom that will be used in real time. Last but not least, reading room with large collection of civil engineering related literatures. Our department is also being facilitated with laboratories which are equipped with modern facilities and competence staff. These laboratories aim to support academic activities such as laboratory work and also research. Currently, there are four laboratories and one studio operating, such as Laboratory of Structures and Construction Material, Laboratory of Soil Mechanic and Geology, Laboratory of Transportation and Remote Sensing, Laboratory of Management Construction, and Studio of Computation and Informatics. 
Currently, our department has undergraduate program and postgraduate program. And now, we are going to tell you more about Civil Engineering Undergraduate Program. Civil Engineering Undergraduate Program is accredited A by Indonesian Accreditation Board of Education since 2013 based on the continuous development of human resources, facilities, curriculum, academic activities, and the graduate. Civil Engineering Undergraduate Program is always in the top 10 in-demand undergraduate program in Universitas Brawijaya every year. At least more than 2,000 prospective students are applying through National College entrance selections. This shows how Civil Engineering Undergraduate Program is well known to have a good and competitive learning environment. Moreover, supports students' activities both in student-operated organization and civil engineering-related competition. Therefore, this program is able to produce the best graduates who have high-qualified soft skills and hard skills. Civil Engineering Undergraduate Program data shows has more than 600 active students in 2018 and 2019 academic years. It takes average 4.02 years for students to complete their studies. Graduates has averaged 3.28 GPA points. It takes average 2.6 months for graduates to get hired. 62% of students are on time in completing their studies. 61% of lecturers hold doctoral degrees. The prospective students' competition ratio is 1 to 39. This shows how competitive it is to be chosen to study in this program. And every year, students get approximately 5 to 6 civil engineering awards from national and international competition. Civil Engineering Undergraduate Program curriculum has been arranged so that students need to acquire minimum of 144 credits that consist of 136 compulsory credits and 8 elective credits in 4 years or 8 semester to be able to graduate. To adapt with development of science, technology, and job vacancies, this curriculum is evaluated every 4 years. Also, in order to maintain a highly qualified educational institution, Civil Engineering Undergraduate Program aims for civil engineering in general, which means Students can learn all the specializations and freely decide their elective undergraduate thesis in choices of structural engineering, geotechnical engineering, transportation engineering, water resources engineering, and construction management. One of the civil engineering undergraduate program courses is Design Studio, where students are assigned to design buildings starting from the planning layout, calculation of the overall structure to the cost estimation. In this course, the class is not held in the classroom, but in the form of a consultation between students and lecturers outside the class. There are two design stages in this course. First is design of multi-story buildings, then design of highway bridges. The aim of this course is that students are expected to be able to apply the knowledge that has been learned in previous semester's courses. So after the graduation, students have knowledgeable experience to design buildings or bridges. As long as I've been studying in Civil Engineering Brawijaya University, I get a lot of knowledge and so many experiences. Knowledge that I got was not only from studying in class, but fortunately I also got the opportunity to participate in Civil Engineering National or International Scale Competition. In this campus, I also feel that I can improve the quality of my soft skills by participating in student organizations and committees. Uh, the things that I like about uh, this campus is we always help each other. Like if our friend doesn't really understand about the lesson, um, we don't mind to teach that person. And so many times we also study outside the classroom together. These things that I said before make me really enjoy learning in this campus, civil engineering, Brawijaya.